My name is Asif Hawk, and I'm a Bangladeshi American artist. I immigrated here when I was eight years old, uh, born in Rome, Italy, and my parents are from Bangladesh. This piece was created 2021, um, and I traveled to London as an adult for the first time. I came across a painting ahead of going to London, which was called The East Offering Its Riches to Britannia, which was created by Sparadine Roma, uh, an Italian artist that was commissioned by the East Indian Company. For me, it just gave me this like sort of reaction, this like, I wanted to speak up because the painting had this brown female figure that was giving her power, she was giving her power away. It took me back to when I was young, as an immigrant, my parents, when they didn't have a voice, and I wanted to speak up for them. I wanted to get up and like talk and be like, hey, no, this is, this is us, this is me, this is my identity. So for me, it was like helping a, uh, helping a family member. And I wanted to sort of recreate a painting. In response, I, I've never felt such strong reaction from a painting. So I wanted to talk and I wanted to paint and I wanted to talk to Sparity. I wanted to tell him, hey, this is what I think. So my characters, in a way, came to rescue her. And that's basically how that painting came about. I think it's important to know that you have a voice. I think that's what I want people to leave with. I think, I think whether uh, the way I created my characters to speak for me, I think my audience, my viewers can also create their own characters that sort of uplift them and um, you know, allow them to feel strong and feel powerful. Through these shows, I think we, we're starting to have that more and more and it's become normalized and I'm so grateful. And it's like, you know, I'm getting goosebumps now, but it's like, it's so powerful to be able to create. And I think the next generation should also know that and, and, and it should continue. And, and I know I'm not the first one and I know I'm not gonna be the last one. And I think it's great and it's exciting to be able to have this. I think it's incredible. I, this is my first painting in a collection. And um, thanks to Pete, thanks to Columbus Museum, I have a voice. Kind of want to thank uh, Tamar Grand uh, Gallery uh, for letting me create in their, in their space. I also want to thank um, Dr. Cleo Roberts. Um, she helped me sort of compose a conversation with Sparadine Roma. After the painting, I felt like I protected her. I protected this figure with my figures, you know? And it's, it's such an interesting place, like, to be able to do that.